Today we're going to have a look around the Wenshu Monastery. But first we're going to grab a quick Xiao Chu, or small eats. There are a lot of Chengdu snacks around the temple area, but my favorite by far has to be the Guo Ke sandwiches that can be found just south of Wenshu Temple Metro Stop Exit K. Just look for the lineup of hungry people. Usually Guo Ke is fried crispy, but this sandwich version is made with freshly baked bread that's stuffed with beef and chili oil. Brown sugar, waiting brown. for one minute. One minute, okay. You can also try the brown sugar version if you prefer something sweet. What? Let me get a shot of that. Jeez, bud. Waste of brown sugar. The Wenshu Monastery is many things. It's the headquarters of the Sichuan Provincial Buddhist Association and the Chengdu Civic Buddhist Association. It's also a tourist attraction, a place to relax, a place to worship, and a home for paintings, relics, and around 80 monks. While the 190 incredibly well-preserved wood and stone structures are quite exquisite, there was nothing quite like the experience we had watching the monks unwind in their courtyard. After wandering the grounds, be sure to explore the streets that surround the monastery. Across from the entrance, you can get an order of sweet water noodles, which are a great snack as you peruse the various vendors. Point of view of the noodle shop, and see there's Sarah, but this is all noodles, baby. We're gonna go through for a little walk. We're gonna take our noodles for a walk. Oh, look at this. Hmm. That's against the law. If that's a bear, that's against the law. 